an issue that's exceedingly important to the nation, to our individual states, and to us as, uh, as senators and representatives of all those millions of, of, millions of folks. And that is infrastructure. Uh, infrastructure, in, in my definition, and I think it's important to define what infra infrastructure is, because I think what we saw from the President's uh, $2.2 .2 trillion package, his definition of infrastructure is, is a lot different than what mine is, although there are a lot of similarities. So I'm the ranking member over on uh, Environment and Public Works. I'm working with Senator Carper every day to try to get a bipartisan surface transportation bill. But that's not the only thing that will be, I think, a part. That's our roads and bridges, our core infrastructure uh, that all of us in our states uh, want and that through the years we've come together in a bipartisan way and negotiated these bills time and time again. The President has solicited our ideas. Some of us have been to the White House to talk to him. His team has been on Capitol Hill. And, uh, and so we are working, I think, to try to get that bipartisan package. But we are very different, I think, when you look at what core infrastructure means to you. I said roads and bridges. I also mean water, wastewater projects, uh, um, our airport uh, modernizations, um, Broadband is a huge part of that, and I'm, I'm probably leaving a couple things out, but I think that's where our core, and I, I characterized it yesterday as our sweet spot. And when I say sweet spot, I think that's the sweet spot of where we can join together and the American people can actually see us negotiate a package that where we all believe very strongly in devoting the resources, the time and effort into modernizing our infrastructure uh, across the country. So we got a lot of speakers. I'm going to stop there and, and turn it over to Senator Wicker.